What's happening guys, it's Shane here and today I have a very special video for you. We are going to be talking about the best associate level majors and associate degrees. And this is a highly requested topic. Uh, these videos always do really well because a lot of people are interested in going to college but they don't necessarily want to go for four years. Especially since you can get an associate's degree at a community college and you don't necessarily have to pay those higher prices to go to a state university or a private university. And also because bachelor degrees let's be honest, a lot of the time do take more than four years. So on this list, I'm going to be going over all different types of degrees. So pretty much no matter what you're interested in, you'll likely see a degree that's somewhat related to that on this list. And we're going to jump right into that right after you know what to do. Gently tap the like button. Let's go for, I don't know, 2,567 likes on this video. And also subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't done that already so that you never miss out on a video. All right, so number 10 on this list is going to be industrial design. Now this one is gonna be for people who are interested in more artistic related degrees. So basically industrial design is where you're going to be drawing up different designs for products that are going to go to mass market. And these are going to be the types of products that have to be mass produced. So they do have to be relatively practical and simple. So you're going to be seeing a lot of simple, sleek and ergonomic designs that can be mass produced. Now with this one, you can start off making about $47,000 a year and mid career pay is 81,000. It does have a 46% meaning score according to pay scale. So that's not that great. But yeah, this one did make it on the list because the statistics are pretty good. And I wanted to include one for people who are interested in art degrees. Number nine is going to be a business degree, and that is going to be management information systems. So if I was to explain management information systems in just a few words, it's basically about 40% business, 30% computer science and 30% IT. So it's a really good combination of business skill set mixed with technology skills. And even at the associate level, you see that this one is relatively good. So for instance, you're going to start off making about $47,000 a year and mid career pay is 81,000. This is also an extremely flexible degree. There's so many different things that you can do because you're basically combining two of the most valuable and most important skills together. Think about it. Just about every company out there of course needs people who are good at business but they also need people who are good at technology and it's very rare to find somebody who is good at both now this one is technically a business degree um, but I would also say that it's relatively easy compared to like say an engineering degree or a physics degree so that's a question I get all the time is you know engineering physics way too hard for me what's a good degree that is a little bit easier and this is definitely one of my top recommendations now if you look at the meaning score on payscale.com it's 48 percent again eh, not that great but of course that depends on what career path you go down and a bunch of other things number eight on the list is going to be occupational health and safety and this is going to be a public health related degree that is going to teach you how to keep the workplace as safe as possible you know a lot of people don't know this but back in the 1800s in the united states children were working and oftentimes dying in factories the working conditions were extremely dangerous and of course things have gotten a lot better these days but this is just a career that makes sure things are as safe as possible so things like making sure that the air quality is clean and making sure that the building isn't going to collapse also this one has a 72 percent meaning score which is fantastic so that is an indicator that you are likely to be more happy in the long run if you choose this career path in this degree next one on the list number seven is going to be information technology management so you're basically going to be managing information that is stored on networks as well as computers so you will be somebody who consults with people if they have some type of issue or error with your computer you'll be installing different programs you'll be updating computers making sure you have the latest cutting edge technology you'll likely be researching and recommending different technology products to the company both hardware and software that fit their specific needs and with this one you'll start off making about $45,000 a year and 80,000 in mid-career pay. So yeah, it can be really good for the right person. You want to be somebody who's really tech savvy. You love computers. You're just interested in that stuff in general. Number six on the list is going to be a health related degree, and that's going to be diagnostic medical ultrasound. This is also known as medical sonography. Now, what everybody thinks of when you say ultrasound or sonography is being able to see a baby when they're still inside of the mother. And that is one of the things you 
learn if you become a sonographer but there's actually a lot of other types of sonography so for instance vascular sonography is used to identify different blockages or clots within the arteries and veins and with this one you can expect to make around fifty-five thousand dollars a year starting out and eighty-one thousand in mid-career pay it also has a whopping 88 percent meaning score and this is something you see in a lot of health related degrees health related careers where people really do think that they're making an impact in the world and that does tend to suggest that it's going to affect your happiness in the long run so you're going to be more satisfied more happy with your career in the long run most likely you still want to do your research on it make sure it's something you're interested in and you're the right type of person for the job number five on the list is going to be project management and this is going to be another business related associate degree so project management is basically where somebody has a plan in order to use a company's resources to figure out how to move a project forward on time so the three big things you're dealing with here are going to be budget time and then the completion of the project itself this is going to involve working with different departments different people as well as different personalities and with this one you can expect to make around fifty thousand dollars a year starting out and eighty five thousand in mid-career pay and the meeting score for this one is a little bit better than some of the other business ones it's about 52 percent number four on the list is going to be electrical and computer engineering so this one is pretty self-explanatory you're going to be working with computers probably designing them and you'll be specifically focusing on the hardware side of things probably about 80 percent but also a little bit on the software as well with this one you can expect to make about forty-seven thousand dollars a year starting out and eighty-seven thousand in mid-career pay it also has a 58 percent meaning score so pretty good next one on the list number three is going to be instrumentation technology so this is another technology related degree and this is one where you're basically going to be working on designing maintaining installing and inspecting different types of instruments that you would find in a company and many companies of course rely on instruments in order to get the daily tasks done so one really obvious example of this would be somebody who checks the instruments that you use in flights and as you can imagine there is a lot of different instruments on an airplane and you want them to be as accurate as possible so with this one you'd start off making about fifty-one thousand dollars a year and mid-career pay is ninety thousand it also has a 59 percent meaning score which is relatively good next one on the list number two is going to be radiation therapy and this is basically going to be the treatment of diseases the most common one of course being cancer using x-ray technology so in radiation therapy you'll be doing a lot of different things you will of course be interacting with the patients you'll be assisting the doctor like checking the charts you'll also be handling a lot of the scheduling and anytime a machine has an issue you will be troubleshooting that issue now with this one you'll start off making about sixty-five thousand dollars a year and ninety-five thousand in mid-career pay absolutely bonkers that is incredible for what is basically an associate level degree and on top of that this one has a ridiculous 92 percent meaning score which you see a lot when it comes to health related degrees so yeah it can be great for the right person uh can be a very stressful job health tends to be very busy uh pretty stressful you see people on their worst days but for the right type of personality this can be a fantastic choice and number one on the list no surprise here at all probably the most valuable skill set you can learn whether it's teaching yourself or getting a doctorate uh, computer science and mathematics I've talked about this one extensively on this channel uh, it's almost like a meme at this point it's number one in many different categories um, so yeah forty five thousand dollars a year starting off hundred and six thousand in mid-career pay does have a 49 percent meaning score so make sure you're interested in computer science and mathematics before going into this don't go into it if you hate it I think that kind of goes with everything on this channel make sure you're actually interested in it uh, don't go into something just for the money but yeah hope you enjoyed the video check my other ones out right here i made them just for you go ahead gently tap that like button hit the subscribe button ring the notification bell and comment down below any thoughts comments criticisms etc and i will see you next time <laughs>